Right now, let's get you the latest developments in the Kalakshetra scandal after a professor was accused of sexual harassment. Kalakshetra board has constituted an independent committee now to inquire again into those allegations of sexual harassment made by a former student. So several students uh, had been protesting inside campus. In fact, this is considered to be one of uh, the most prestigious art uh, colleges and art uh, universities in Tamil Nadu. And there were not one but uh, several students who had alleged uh, sexual harassment. In fact, uh, Sam Daniel is now joining us live on the broadcast. Sam, so um, you know, swift action uh, by uh, the uh, the university, the Kalachetra so Institute. Action after uh, the arrest of the exactly. professor. Yeah. Many would call it too little too late, uh, Vedanta and uh, Gargi, because initially the Kalachitra management, particularly the director, uh, denied any allegations of uh, sexual harassment on campus by students, and they even called it as an attempt to tarnish the institute image as part of a disinformation campaign. But only after students protested and it persisted, now they have appointed an independent committee. This committee constitutes Justice K. Kanan, retired judge, and former DGP of Tamil Nadu, Latika Saran, and Dr. Shobha Vardhaman. And these three members would now inquire into these allegations. And then uh, already the uh, director has said the board would not spare anyone found guilty of any unsavory act. And this comes also after the arrest of uh, one of the assistant professors uh, uh, yesterday, Hari Padman, and... Uh, in investigations underway, he has been remanded to judicial custody. The management has also suspended him and has also recommended dispensing, engaging three other uh, what they call as repertory artists uh, by the management till the inquiry is completed. And as we speak now, the State Women's Commission is also uh, inquiring into the matter. The State Women's Commission chairperson had a one-on-one -on -one meeting in person and online with 12 individuals who had specific complaints to make. And so far, at least 90 students, both men and women, have given complaints individually to the Commission on allegations of sexual harassment, body shaming and verbal abuse over the last few years. And the arrest of this particular faculty member came after a former student who was doing her post-graduation a few years ago. At that time, she alleges this particular professor had sought sexual favors. And when she said no, uh, he targeted her in terms of denying her opportunities and also spreading canons about her. And it was on her complaint police have arrested and they're also hoping that many other students who have given complaints to the women's commission would come forward and muster enough courage to file a police complaint as well so that right. the other so Sam, are, are the students can also be uh, investigated that's right so sam are the students now satisfied with the action yesterday the arrest finally taking place now a committee set up finally to look into the matter and the professor being suspended It appears so we are awaiting a formal statement from the student body, Garki, but uh, their main demand was reconstitution of the inquiry committee, the internal complaints committee, and also inclusion of a student representative in that committee. Besides action in terms of uh, they wanted sacking of these four uh, faculty members and repertory artists who they blame for sexual harassment. Uh, informally, they say they're quite happy, but we're waiting for a formal response to understand uh, what their stand is. But the college has been shut down and the exams have been rescheduled.